All right, everybody, we got an exciting cutting, egg cutting for you today. Um, this is from my pastel female to my pastel banana pinstripe cinnamon, most likely spider male. And so I'm really excited to get this egg cut uh, going. So let's get into this. Okay, so we've got seven awesome looking eggs in this clutch. It is, we are cutting on day like 61, I want to say. So I can feel the babies in there. Yep. Very nice. They are ready. So I do run my, my incubator a little bit cool. So that's why they're not pipped yet at day 60, but they're certainly ready. Okay. Start things off. Okay, we've got a banana. Um, I don't know if there's cinnamon in it or not. Make sure he's doing good. Yeah. Yep, got a little reaction from it. Most likely a boy, since the banana is linked, sex linked, and my banana uh, breeder is a boy. So one banana. I've never hatched a banana out before. It might even be banana pinstripe. A little hard to tell. Or excuse me, not banana pinstripe, banana pastel. Pretty neat to hatch bananas, <laughs> if you ask me. Okay. Ooh, okay. This is a pewter. Wow, so cool. So this is a pastel cinnamon. Wow. I've never I've never hatched a pewter before either, too. Doing good. So that's most likely a female. Since the males will most likely be carrying the banana gene. Unless my male is a female maker, which would be great, but I highly doubt it. <laughs> Wow. Always fun to cut eggs. Okay. So this is, ooh, this is a banana pinstripe, most likely pastel. That is pretty. Let's take a look. Yeah, doing good. Yep, moving around in there. Yeah, very, very cool. I'm surprised we haven't hit any spider yet. Um, pretty sure the male is spider. He, he's got a little bit of a head wobble, so I'm expecting some spider. I didn't buy him wanting the spider gene, um, but the, the breeder mis-ID'd it. So that's okay. Accidents happen. Gotta get a little bit of get gotta give a little bit of leeway sometimes with those things. Alright. Okay. Ooh, okay. This is a super pastel cinnamon or a I don't know super pewter. <laughs> I don't know how you would say that and it looks like it might be banana as well interesting we'll have to see that that might be it's either a super pure uh super pastel cinnamon or a pastel 
uh, cinnamon banana. That is a cool one. Like it. Gotten getting a lot of variation so far in all the babies. That is really exciting. So we've done four eggs, have some great, lots of variety so far. Got three more to go. Let's take a look. Take a look. It's in a book. <laughs> <laughs> take a look. It's in an egg. Okay, this is a, ooh, this one looks more, yeah, this one is probably a banana spider. Um, as far as I can tell, that's what it looks like to me. Got a lot of goopiness in this, this egg. So banana spider, most likely. I, I've never hatched out a spider before, so, you know, we won't know for sure the genetics on everything until, until they actually come out of the egg. All right, here we go. Actually, let's just do this. Let's do it like Billy. Just put the egg on the paper towel. Cool, wow, so much variation. I love seeing all of that. Okay. Oh, okay. This one looks like a super pastel. Wow. Most likely, let's see. I don't think it's a super pastel cinnamon, but yeah, it looks like a super pastel. I don't think it's just a regular pastel because it's so, so white. So I guess we'll check it when it's out. Cool. Super pastel. Now, let's see. So, so far we've got one, two, three, three bananas. So we're about 50-50 on the odds for the gender. So that's good. Because the bananas should be boys and everything else should be females. Last egg. Let's see, what do I want to hit? I want to hit a banana, pinstripe, pastel cinnamon, actually a super pastel cinnamon. But I don't know if, if that's, that's five genes. That's pretty hard to hit that many genes in one snake, so. But we'll see if we can hit it with this one. Okay. Okay, looks like a banana pewter. Wow, that looks fantastic. Hey everybody, my battery just died, so I just recharged it and just thought I'd do a, a clutch recap here for you. All right, so here's a little recap for you. Little banana pinstripe right there. Looking good. This one lo does look like a banana pewter. Let's see if I can zoom in and focus in on that a little bit better. That's looking nice. This one right here appears to be a, uh, most likely a banana spider. And then moving down the line, we've got either a banana pastel or a banana pewter. It's a little hard to tell on this one, so we'll see. Oh, well, when it comes out of the egg, I'll do a recap then. This one right here, I think I, I, I did it as a banana, but I'm pretty sure it's a banana cinnamon. It's quite a bit darker. It has a little, lot more uh, dark purple than the others. The others are quite a bit lighter. This one right here is upside down, but it's a, uh, it's a pewter. Looking good. And then, of course, last but not least, 
a uh, super pastel. So, yeah, looking great. Really excited for these snakes to come out of the egg. So until next time, we'll catch you guys. We'll catch you guys later. Thank you.